is nearing the end of the spring concert series and the New Hampshire Gay Men's Chorus is busy. On this night, they performed a free outreach program for a nursing home in Manchester. And it fills me up with hope and goodwill. It's really heartwarming for us to see the smiles on their face and we're so close to them rather than being up on a stage. The chorus performs all over the Granite State at a wide range of events. The Windham Pride Festival, Fisher Cats Games, the 200th anniversary of the First Baptist Church in Nashua, and at political events. They sang at Disney World, and twice they have performed at the State House for Governor Sununu, who called them truly a Granite State musical treasure. The group says they are more popular than ever. But 25 years ago, they had to overcome fears and doubts as they tried to establish themselves. Even their name was different in the beginning. We called ourselves the Manchester Performing Arts Association. It was what we would say our beard. Uh, so we didn't want to be that open. Um, a lot of men in this situation, like when we did the first concert, they had to uh, put sunglasses on. They didn't want anybody to know who they were. But decades later, they are proudly the New Hampshire Gay Men's Course. The message from this group is about inclusion and acceptance. While sometimes pride-related, they say their music is not political. Everything from Broadway musicals to popular modern tunes. They are so good, they are defined by their music, not their title. So do they need the word gay in their name? It's a great question. Do we need it? For a lot of people, it's a point of pride. I think it is important to stand up and tell not just the members that are singing, but the people in our audiences that they can be themselves. The New Hampshire Gay Men's Chorus performs four holiday concerts and four more in the spring, plus several outreach concerts like this one. They've made it 25 years, and here's to 25 more from the New Hampshire Gay Men's Chorus. I think we're in such a great place now than we were 25 years ago. More accepting. We've come a long way, but we still have ways to go. We have a great audience that loves us not just because we're the gay men's chorus, but because we put on a good performance. I have never been happier or prouder to be a part of this organization, and I see wonderful things going ahead. Hallelujah. In Manchester, Jamie Staten, WMUR News 9.